What's up, guys? This is the Rifleman, and I am back to bring you to a very what is going to be a very short and very bloody last episode to my Portugal campaign um, because we've stacked the deck against against uh, Saxony, and for whatever reason, they elected in a few turns before to kind of disperse all their troops. So they've got two full armies, well, roughly two full armies, up into the north where they cannot help them. And, uh, yes, I can't remember which I was going to be you, wasn't it? I would imagine. We're going to attack the city of Dresden, destroy the garrison, and bring it into the fold, and take the second to last territory of this campaign. So it's country, a faction that I brought into being through my own goodwill. Saxony. Actually, did I? I might not have done. I think I just helped them. Yes, that's true. I don't think I, I don't think you can bring countries into being in Empire. I think they rebelled and then I just allied with them and helped them and gave them lots of money and technology to try and get going. So now <laughs> we help them just enough so that we could destroy them. It's gonna be a swarm through the woods. Artillery back here is not a great idea because they haven't got very good fields of fire. It's going to end up being over here. Now, to be honest, I'm actually going to spend put the bulk of my troops in the clear ground. Put some frontiersmen. They can kind of skirt the edge of the town. Keep my cavalry to, sl to slam into people that are going to try and push through. But for the most part, flank around. I'm not going to use quick climb because that will just be mean. Okay. Lots of enemies, lots of stuff going on. Just run. Infantry form square. Tribal auxiliary. Form square. And wherever hasn't formed square. Tribal Auxiliary push forward and skirmish. The right flank of our line push up as planned. The Lancer Guards got trashed. Native Bowman Auxiliary push up in. You're in the front line now. Get my proper skirmishes up. Native Pueblo Auxiliary up on the flank. Where's my Curacier? Get them to loop around. Ah, Put your lights in position. Native American. Not like my Native American. My American Infantry Mercenaries. Push forward and put the enemy under fire. Who? They look really cool. I really like my color, those colours. Blue and white looks pretty nice. The Kupinzessin Grenadiers. Militia. Garrison line. I mean, generally I like I quite like the Saxon colour scheme. Saxony colour scheme. Engineers. Quite similar. And they're being slaughtered. Oh god, my knees don't get into position. They're not gonna be alive for long. Who's that out here? Hey little fella! looks like there is a desire to work their way through the town towards us. I think Portuguese line is just too damn powerful. We've broken their right flank.
might clip the edge of those stakes, but that's fine. I'm not really bothered about the skirmishes. But my cavalry on the left... I mean, this is quite a... It's the east, so the sun is setting. Okay, how it says fire on, onto troops in the town. Let's probably re-shift my mercenaries. Lancer guards. Lancer guards want in. Skirmishes and light troops just picking these guys apart. Excellent volley, just annihilate a bunch of Lancer guards. Their artillery's firing as fast as they can. I don't think it's going to help them. Take a little bit of extra bow fire. Just to confuse things a little bit. Push my cuirassier towards the labour ground is spiffy. Prince Albrecht Chevaulegier. Yeah, they look pretty good. folded. We've looped around the edge. They're not able to respond. Cressier smacked the engineers. So our artillery is make, doing damage on troops inside the town, but they have managed to pick their way pick their way through and do damage to us. So if our Cressier can hack open these engineers. I'm going to let these Prince Albrecht Chevalier be engaged by my native cavalry. Then I'm going to charge my Cressier in. No, 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 no. Send in native... Americans on horseback, the one thing they didn't expect to see, fighting over the plains of Central Europe. Taken the tree, we've taken the infantry line. Let's send the native bowman auxiliary in. Howitzers slam shots down into the fifth. It's cavalry detachment that hasn't done any work. Hello, what's this? Good artillery, all of you engage the garrison the militia. Axe wielding, hatchet, tomahawk wielding Native Americans are going to clear out the artillery batteries. Cavalry. Oh, yes, I forgot about their reinforcements entirely. In which case, you guys... ...need to progress into the... ...town and secure it. Give them higgledy-piggledy orders for now. guys can push around the flank of the town. Okay, so you form square, you're going to defend yourself. 
Distillery on Limber. How it says drop shells on the Bon Shucha Bazaars. Barely bog standard is ours to me. Gracier, get, get take out the gendarmerie. Specifically, aren't going after the square formation. This infantry form up here and begin engaging the square with volley fire. Okay, we'll hack down their sails. They only lost 16 men and they broke. Guns to redeploy over here. Not that they'll ever really get there. A few men form up here. Garcia, get over here. Light cavalry, get over here. Trap against the blender by shotgunners. Artillery, all my howards are going to play a quick climb against the provincial militia because right now they are. in a tricky spot. Just deploying square. Then you'll like have uh, Garcia get up here and help that infantry regiment. Excellent. Push forward, men. Everybody's advancing up nicely. The militia have broken under. Concentrated quick line fire, which is delightful. The general still hasn't seen any action. Infantry mercenaries push up. Cavalry, cavalry form up. One of the best shotgunners, they're bouncing up to point blank range. Bad news for them. Maybe this is a bad idea. Send my cavalry against the artillery. They broke. Cavalry's about. The yeah, artillery's about to break. But they look good. Three uniforms with red facing bits, lapels, and so on. How about you? Crack 
crush and kill the artillery. Not that it matters, because we are not. This is not going to be a full length part. There we go. Excellent job. Crushed the garrison of Dresden. They don't, they're not really happy with it, which I'm not surprised by. Good university here, which doesn't help. I'll get rid of it just out of habit. Let's push everyone forward just again out of, out of habit. And Matthias Pinto, you've been with us for a very long time. You can complete the attack. Lots of hussars and just lots of cavalry. What a big mistake this is. For them, that is. Your burn, Cursier. See you later, Saltzman, the last governor of Berlin, before the Portuguese come in and take over. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Well, this campaign's progressed rather nicely. Very, very nicely indeed. This is the fourth, uh, the fourth president. I imagine, I take it he was not very impressed. Ah oh, well, didn't talk much after that. So let's get cracking. Last battle of this campaign. Yeah, but the campaign as a whole went really well. Zero complaints here. It just... Once you knocked out Spain, and then took Paris. Your your empire consists of three incredibly wealthy and powerful cities. There was just yeah, it just went really well after that. The one thing you could be sure of was lots of money in good units and good garrisons as well. Importantly. No, um, quick climb again. I do want all my artillery just to smash their, their cavalry. So we're going to push forward to the clear ground and spread out. It looks like they desire to charge me. which case my cover on the left reorientate land round shot into their cover you do plenty of damage Put my general inside of my yeah, it's only a regiment of horse Cavalry charge noises. It's probably not the best time to be fiddling with my blanks. This is this is bad. This is actually not very good at all. Form squares. He does a curious air, so they do. They can do work. Let me target my everybody. Okay, you put a volley in. Excellent work. That's cleared them out. <laughs> it's a bit spicy there for a minute. Pursue and destroy the Hussars.
unlimber, board line. This fella looks pretty happy until we give him some good blasts of shrapnel shot. Use two units against him, against that unit because they're quite, they are quite strong. How it's his focus on the horse grading guards. When the cavalry pushes forward, they're going to get picked off by my irregulars. So these guys are, they're already depleted. against the flank of the enemy. towards the enemy artillery position. So we're blasting the militia. We're blasting those horse grand air guards. Good hits. Switch to round shot. Blast those grenadiers in their formations. Oh, it says open fire. Run right into their muzzle. You guys can pick at the artillery. Grenadiers are ready to defend the flank in case they come after us. Cavalry advance up into the town. The all artillery smash those grenadiers. The skirmish is going to start picking off the gun crews. Ceasefire. Carabinia just get into position and just put a foot. Blast some shots into them. General's bodyguards going down. Blunderbuss shotgunners. More of them. Not even going to protect your general. Get 
smash the militia. To the militia don't get involved. <laughs> they got nothing. Bring the general up. Go gorilla. Excellent shots. Ah, oh, beta charge, the last act of the Saxon Empire. Ah, oh, they didn't make the charge. They didn't ram the charge home. Yeah, you better run. Hey, mercenaries! Retarget. Oh, the artillery's. The artillery broke them. Broke them enough. They look nice as well. Oh no. <laughs> they couldn't make their mind if they wanted to be here or if they didn't. But there we go. There goes the Saxon Empire. And that is the end of my Portuguese campaign. I don't know why I kind of just do this. It's just habit, I suppose. To just re repair everything. But yes, the entire map is now covered in the flags of Portugal. There is nothing and nobody else in the known world that can stop us. Fleets are beyond count. Our armies are all powerful. Nobody, nobody can withstand us and we've created a global dynasty. And the final check is always click on the diplomacy tab. There's no one else to speak to because we rule everything with, our, with Maria Sophia the First, who's not a very good monarch. No sense of shame. Morally impaired. With a pet hermit. Got a controller. It's not useful. Minus 4% bonus. To tax global tax income. That's not very good. But we get extra management for the treasury. I mean, our government's pretty good. Well, let's look at our income. So, yeah, incoming, bringing in more than half a million a turn in tax. Spending 311,000 that, keeping up our army, army and navy. So we're getting roughly a quarter mil every end turn. <laughs> it's pretty, pretty nice. Um, but yes, thank you for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed. I'm sorry it's a short one, but that's kind of how the episodes kind of broke up. And I'll see you next time for the start of a brand new campaign, which will be. Uh, the United, United States with the additional units mod installed. Because when I played it way back in 2014, I didn't have the mod installed. So it will be a bit different with a few extra units. And should be a bit more interesting. But there we go. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed. And have a good one.